Welcome back to our channel, Fast Cabling. So today we're tackling a crucial question. Analog cameras or IP camera? Which one should you choose for your security system? So in today's video, we'll unravel the differences between analog cameras and IP cameras, helping you make an informed decision about your security needs. And if you have any question with your system design, please feel free to contact us through the link down in the description box below. And our team of experts will provide you with a solution tailored to your specific need. So today we're diving into the intriguing world of civilian camera, analogs versus IP camera. In our fast-paced digital age, it is crucial to understand the differences between these two camera types. Analog camera, with their long-standing presence in the market, offer reliability and simplicity. While IP camera, the newer entrant, provides seamless integration into the digital network. So the choice between these technologies significantly impacts your security setup. So analog cameras are the foundation of many security systems. These cameras operate by capturing video signal and transmitting them over coaxial cable to a digital video recorder, a DVR. Their simplexity lies in their fundamental design. They capture and send footage without complex digital processing. And one of the standout features is affordability. Analog systems are generally more budget-friendly, both in terms of the camera cost and infrastructure. And their straightforward setup and maintenance make them an attractive choice, especially for those looking for a cost-effective solution without compromising on security. So analog cameras offer several compelling advantages that have contributed to their enduring popularity in the realm of civilian technology. Firstly, this camera excels in low light condition, providing reliable performance even in environment with limited illumination. Their ability to capture clear footage in various lighting situations ensure constant civilian efficiency, and enhancing the overall security. Secondly, Analog camera come with minimal network bandwidth requirement, making them ideal for setup where network bandwidth needs to be optimized. And this characteristic ensures smooth video transition without putting undue pressure on the existing network infrastructure. While analog cameras offer several advantages, they do come with certain limitations that might affect their suitability for specific civilian needs. Firstly, analog cameras have limited resolution, which means they may not capture fine details as clearly as high-resolution digital cameras. Secondly, Analog camera lack advanced feature like remote access. They do not offer the convenience of real-time remote monitoring using the internet or mobile devices. And thirdly, scalability can be a challenge with analog system. Expanding an analog civilian setup often involves wiring, and particularly in a large or multi-site installation. And this difficulty in scalability can hinder the system's ability to grow with evolving security requirements. So next we are going to talk about the IP cameras. Internet protocol cameras convert video footage into digital data within the camera itself. And this digital data is then transmitted over a computer network, including the internet, allowing for remote viewing and storage. IP cameras don't require a separate DVR as they have a built-in processing power to manage the video feed. Their reliance on the internet for data transmission means they can be accessed and controlled from anywhere within an internet connection. So due to their digital nature and internet connectivity, IP cameras are particularly well suited for more complex civilian setup, offering advanced functionalities and seamless integration with modern network infrastructures. While IP cameras offer advanced features and flexibility, they do come with certain limitations that need consideration. Firstly, IP cameras often involve a higher initial cost due to their digital nature, high-resolution capabilities, and advanced functionality.
IP cameras are generally more expensive than analog alternatives. Secondly, IP cameras depend on a stable network connection. Their functionality relies heavily on the internet or local network. Any network issue, such as downtime or bandwidth limitation, can impact the camera's performance, leading to potential gaps in civilian coverage. And lastly, IP cameras require a more complex setup and maintenance, demand a more intricate network setup, and this complexity can make the initial installation more challenging, especially for users who are not familiar with networking concept. And additionally, ongoing maintenance and troubleshooting might require a certain level of technical expertise, adding to the overall complexity of IP-based civilian systems. So in comparison, analog cameras are ideal for small businesses and homes where a few cameras are needed. They're budget-friendly and require minimal technical expertise. For instance, a small retail store with a limited budget might benefit from analog camera placed strategically to cover essential area. On the other hand, IP cameras are excel in larger installation, such as corporate offices, warehouses, or expensive residential properties. In scenario where remote monitoring and high-resolution footage are vital, like in a large warehouse with valuable inventory. And IP cameras offer real-time assets and detailed images for effective security management. So the choice between these two depends on the specific requirement, budget constraint, and the scale of the civilian system that need it. So here we have the analog camera and an IP camera. This one is the 5MP PoE bullet IP camera with very focal lens. It is a high-quality, professional-grade civilian camera that delivers exceptional image clarity and superior performance. The adjustable very focal lens allows you to adjust the focal length manually and giving you the flexibility to zoom in or out as needed for optimal civilians. And also, it is equipped with human detection and vehicle detection. This one here is our 4K analog bullet camera with motorized lens. It delivers sharp and detailed footage, allowing you to zoom in without losing any clarity. And it typically requires lower bandwidth, which is beneficial when network resources are limited. And with its easy installation and setup process, you have it up and running in no time. So analog camera are budget friendly and suitable for a smaller setup, offering simplicity and reliability, while IP camera provide high resolution, detailed image, remote access, and scalability, making them perfect for a larger and more complex setup. And by evaluating all the factors like budget, desired feature, and the scale of your civilian needs, now you can make an informed decision that aligns with your goal and resources. So that's all for today. Thank you very much for joining us. And I'll see you in the next video.